Um, with Rob Egan upstairs and Ian Brandon downstairs, I'm Drew Egan. Um, and today we're going to be bringing you uh, Chicago going up against each other. What's what's the first thing that comes to mind to you? Well, first thing that comes to mind to me is the very young New York Yankees lineup. As you know, the Yankees did have the best farm system in all baseball last season. You're seeing some of those guys make their major league debut and really playing a big role in the MLB world as they're producing good for their team. And uh, so... All right, thank you, and uh, let's get set, and we are ready for some afternoon baseball. First pitch is next. With Rob Egan upstairs and Ian Brandon downstairs, I'm Drew Egan. Here it is, the home of the Chicago White Sox since the 1990s or 80s, 1996, I believe. Today, game one of the Big Series 11 between the New York Yankees and the Chicago White Sox. White Sox baseball coming up next. Jose Quintana, a right-hander from the Dominican Republic, is on the mound here. And what's the word on him? I don't really know. <laughs> That's pretty good. <laughs> Brett Gardner will lead it off here, and we are just about set for Leading some afternoon, afternoon baseball. Fielder, like, see how Brett Gardner does 11. this uh, this game. He is having a very good start to the season. First pitch. Ooh, what a miss. Nice curveball right for strike one. Oh, one. Line drive foul. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Hit him. <laughs> and as you take a look at these White Sox, what's the first thing that comes to mind? Uh. <laughs> their socks are white. <laughs> yeah. Here's on ball to a Bray, and that's yeah. the first out of the inning. And with Not that, let's take a look at the Center New York Fielder. Yankees starting Jeff lineup Kobe presented Ellsbury. by Majestic. And what's a key, a key factor? we got to look at that starting lineup. You have the veteran Jacoby Ellsbury and Matt Holliday and Scar Starlin Castro. And as you get down in the order, you get to see Aaron Judge and Ronald Torres, all the you know, young rookies who have been coming up. And here's Jacoby Ellsbury, the center fielder. He is hitting pretty good baseball. He did, in fact, hit a home run in Pittsburgh in the last ser in the series they faced against the Pirates that they Was, lost. I believe the only run. Oh, oh, it looks like he's swinging butterflies. <laughs> Still at one. 73 degrees, party cloudy. 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 <laughs> oh, one. Line drive, base hit. Ronald Melky. Reach for safely for the first Yankees hit of the game. I like how he Johnny approaches Curry, this. The designated hitter. Yeah, he sees an inside Matt pitch, Holliday. yet he does pull, uh, hit it offset field. And Tim and Anderson did nothing. And that'll bring up the veteran right fielder, Matt Holliday. Worth it. <laughs> and that's a nice curveball there, and so in one on Holliday. I believe for the first three batters, uh, the White Sox side has been throwing three start curveballs. See if he continues that. Line drive, just foul. The ball boy slacking. There's the O2. Downstairs, and it's one and two. A little tapper. Tim Anderson will get it. Uh, second out. <laughs> Batting fourth. Very good crowd on for today. Starlin Castro. And so here's Starlin Castro. Last year he hit 21 home runs, and this year he's putting up some big numbers. Here's the first pitch. Swing and a miss on a lively fastball, and it's strike one. 
Oh, that was in good time. Castro 0 for 14 against Quintana. In the dirt. Smith throws, but not in time. He's in there. Ellsbury with that great speed. Steal second. On the pass, or on the likely rolled a wild pitch. Now, two outs, runner in second, Yankees have a chance to do something. Here's the 1-1. One, one. Downstairs, and it's 2-1. and one. <laughs> Here's the 2-1 pitch. Fly ball. Melky coming on, coming on, coming on. And he won't get it. So down go the... Yankees, uh, they leave one at scoring position, but cannot bring him home. We are going to the bottom of the first. New York Yankees, nothing, and the Sox are coming to bats. You're listening, but Ian, who's, what's the word on him? Well, he came up last year, and I believe the year before that, too. He struggled a little bit, and coming into this year, he was really looking to improve his record and ERA. And beginning a season like this is where you can... And Set the term for the, the season. Sox. Tim Anderson will lead it off here. The Tim rookie shortstop. Anderson. Here's the first pitch. Take for a strike. Anderson didn't like the call by the home plate umpire Bob Ferguson. Here's the 0-1 pitch. Swing and a miss. Nice slider there oh, by Severino, and it's 0 and 2. Here's the 0-2. Outside, oh. and that's ball one. There's some looking to get on base here. 1-2 pitch. Swing and a miss. Nice slider there, and that's the first out of the inning. And with that, let's take a look at the how the Sox line up in order. Ian, uh, who's a key factor that stands out to you? We got to get to two and three spot. Melky Cabrera and Jose Abreu both batting very well, almost at 300. So it's a big thing to see how they play in today's game. And here comes Melky, former Yankee. He actually played for the Trenton Thunder. Yes, that is right. Back in the days. And here is the first pitch. Fly ball hit well. Under the baseball. Hit well. Please. Gardner. No. Gardner is there. <sighs> Warning tracks. Nice hit there by Batting Melky, third. but first Gardner baseman. able to corral it. And here comes the slugger, Jose Abreu. Hit his 100th career home run last night against Seattle. Way high, and it's ball one. The 0-1, one over. Taking first strike. No. Change up oh. just inside or outside. Two more. Fly ball hit well. Ellsbury, running, 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 and oh! makes the catch. <laughs> and that is the end of the first. Aaron Judge will lead Yankees. it off here, and the what right a big year he's having for the Yankees this Aaron year. Seems like he picked Judge. up right where he left off last season. You see Gary Sanchez doing very well, and Aaron Judge came up as well, and these baby bombers really going to be the future of this Yankees First roster. Swing and a miss. Nice lively curveball there. And it's With good timing too. Sanchez gets the night off. Here's the 0-1 pitch. Fouled off. We will be playing a double header today, so stay tuned for that. Here's the 0-2 pitch. Ground ball. Nice play by her by Carlos Sanchez. Great off. Mm -hmm. Great play there to get Batting Judge set. out of off base. All right, let's Gregory. take a look at the White Sox defense. 
and who stands out to you? Well, you gotta look at the outfield there. Melky Ferrer, Willie Garcia, the rookie, and... Avisail Garcia. And uh, uh, to me, I think I'm looking at uh, seeing what Willie Garcia can do. Oh, and yeah. I think, um, you know, obviously a veteran big player in the big series, played for Altoona, played for Charlotte, now playing for Chicago. He's been everywhere. Here's the first pitch. The familiar yeah. face in this big series. Beautiful day here in guaranteed right field. Is this our current field or? Yes. All right. Fly ball. Hit well. Garcia under it. And Willie will make the catch. There's two down. The top of the second. Batting seventh. First baseman, Chris Carter. And that'll bring up the big Chris Carter. Struggling a little bit at the beginning of this year, but man, he can put up some numbers. Here's the first pitch from Santana. Popped up. Abreu going out, going out. And Ben. <laughs> oh, and makes boy. The catch. How about that for a first baseman? And that's the end of the. That, and then we were going to the bottom of the second. It is still nothing, nothing. Here's Avisail Garcia. And leading off for the White Sox. You see, last right season he had 12. Home he started his MLB Garcia. career in Detroit. Former Erie Seawold. Here is the first pitch. Zero. Oh, looks like he's chasing butterflies with that swing. It's nothing in one. It seemed like he just got around a little bit late with that 96 mile per hour fastball. Oh, one. Foul no tipped in the pitcher, catcher's glove. And it's 0 oh, and 2. 0 oh, 2 pitch. Line drive. Dee Dee leaps. Can't get it. And I would say you, Garcia's on base for the first White Sox hit of the day. And that'll bring up the veteran third baseman Todd Frazier. Frazier. I believe this is his second season with the White Sox. He after coming from after, the after, Reds organization. After, yeah, after coming from the Cincinnati Reds. He was a home run derby winner, wasn't he? Yes, he was. 2015 home run derby champion in Cincinnati. Oh okay. my gosh! Ground ball. This should be two. And one's all they'll get. And that's going to be a fielder's choice for Todd Frazier. So here comes Matt Davidson. Third baseman, Matt Davidson. Zero. Ooh. Looks like he checked his swing, but he clearly broke, broke the plane. That's strike one. Fly ball hit well. Ellsbury under the baseball. And he catches it for the second out of the inning. All right. So here comes Carlos Sanchez. Carlos Sanchez. 208 average last season with four home runs. First pitch. In there for a strike. Trying to look that runner over. Ground ball. Castro, nice. Oh, and he oh. pulls him off the bag. And now there's runner in scoring position for catcher. Kevin Smith. Kevin Smith. The rookie catcher. Spend most of most of last year in Triple A Charlotte. Line drive, base hit. Here comes the runner home. And Sanchez the third, and that's going to be an RBI double for batting ninth center fielder Willie. That's going to be an RBI double for Kevin Smith. And I'll bring up the veteran center fielder Willie Garcia. Oh, looks like <laughs> that. I don't know if you can get fooled much than he did. It's right <laughs> one. Swing and a miss. One nothing socks. 
Runners on second and third. Way inside. That'll get him up. <laughs> Woke him up a little bit. Swing and a miss. Nice slider, and that ends the inning. But the White Sox do get one on the RBI double by Kevin Smith. And we are going to the top of the third. It is one nothing Sox. You're listening to Big Series Baseball. Beautiful skies here in downtown Chicago on the south side. Okay, so here's the veteran catcher, Leading Austin Rowline. Catcher, Austin Taking over Romo. Gary Sanchez, and Sanchez will play in game two. First pitch. Fly ball, that's going to be foul. Romine is a familiar face in this. He played in the big series three. It's in the in the last big series, and that's taken down for ball one. One one. Here mm -hmm. is the mm -hmm. one two. Fly ball. Garcia charging. And he will make the catch. Batting ninth, third baseman. And here Ronald comes the Torres. speedy Ronald Torres. Hang some pretty good numbers this season. First pitch, take it for a strike, nice curveball. See, not the, as you can see, not the tallest uh, player in the league. Oh, one. Ooh, that's, excuse me, it's one, and that's going to now. Here's the O2. Fly ball. Little flare. Sanchez going out, going out, and he runs it down to make the catch. Nice play there by Carlos. Well, left fielder number 11. Brett Gardner. And here comes the top of the order for the Yankees as what as veteran left fielder Brett Gardner will step to the plate for the second time. He flew out last time. First pitch, swing and a miss. Owen one. Oh one. Ground ball, base hit. Gardner's on, he's one for two. Good piece of hitting there. Now batting. You see here, gets a nice contact on Jacobi the ball. Ellsbury. And here comes Jacoby Ellsbury. First pitch. Fouled off, and it's strike one. Oh, one pitch. Oh, one. me down low. Ball one. There's the manager, Rick Renteria, in his first season with Sox. He was the manager for the Chicago Cubs nope. a year Ooh. ago. And look out, that'll wake up Ellsbury. Chirping down at Quintana. <laughs> Two and one now. Line drive. Nice play by Abreu. Nice snag over that'll, there. First. That'll rob Ellsbury of a hit, and that'll end the top half of the Yankees as we're going to the bottom of the third. Still one nothing Sox. So here's Tim Anderson now. And leading off for the White Sox, the shortstop, Tim Anderson. Hey, yeah. How you doing, Rob? Doing well, how are you? Good. Here's the first pitch to Tim Anderson. Taking low for ball one. One oh. Ooh, chasing in the dirt. And it's one and one now. Boys? No. One one pitch. Yeah, I'll be there today and tomorrow. What time you play today? I think five is the yeah. Here's five the one two up. from Severino. Swing and a miss, and down goes Anderson for the second time. It's one away. <laughs> Here's Melky. Oh for one, flew out last time. Melky Cabrera. 
Swing and a miss. How was prom? It was really fun. I enjoyed it. Here's the only pitch. Line drive foul. Here's the 2 Down low. My drive. DD catches it, apparently. One less he said he caught it. That's the second out. Exit. The first baseman, number 79. Sears Jose, Jose Abreu. Abreu. Hit his 100th career home run against way outside. That's ball one. One ball, no strike. So we're going to say go to 31 pitches. One and oh. He's just oh. outside. Not that much, though. It's 2 and 0. I believe Luis Severino disagrees with that one. Two zero. Ground ball. A little tapper. Bare hand play over right. there by the third baseman Torres, and that'll end the inning. So it's no runs, no hits, no errors, and we are going to the top of the fourth. It is still one nothing Sox. You are listening to Big Series Baseball. And here comes Matt Holliday, for the Yankees. having a Designated great year. Matt Holliday, walk off grand slam. First pitch. Oh, Tano wanted that one, but he didn't get it. He thought that was a strike. <laughs> so we are visited inside the booth by my little sister Regina Egan. And down, low. down low. Where are you going, Dad? Where are you going? Take it to the ball for a little bit. All right. All right. See you. See ya. Do a broken Broke. bat. Anderson picks it up. Fires the first in time. Looks like the bat was going to get pulled around the ball for a second. 14. Second baseman. Here Starling comes Casper. Sterling Cat. First pick. Fly ball. I would say it. Catches it. Second out. The right fielder, number 99. Here comes Aaron Big Aaron Judge. And when he says big, he means big. Here is the first pick. <sighs> Here is the one pitch. Swing and a miss. Oh, two. Here's the two. No, Just low. Ball. One, ball. one and two. two Drive by Judge. A fans full of umpires disagrees on that <laughs> one. One two pitch. Line drive, base hit, almost nails Fontana. And Judge is on board, and the Yankees continue to hit to keep this fourth inning alive. Now batting, shortstop, Didi Gregorius. So here's Didi. First pitch, ground ball. Sanchez picks it up, fires easily, inside. And that'll end the inning. So the Yankees do get a hit, but they cannot capitalize. And we go to the bottom of the fourth. It is one nothing, good guys. We're listening to <laughs> big series baseball. Obviously, you up the bat. The fourth for the White Sox. This right pitcher is still going pretty strong. Swing and a miss. That was a power swing right there, and it's strike one. Oh, one. No. Just Down a little. Uh, one ball, one strike. Severino wanted that call, but he didn't get it by home plate umpire Bob Ferguson. Way up there, and that will wake him up a bit. Here is the 2-1 pitch. Down low, it's 3-1. 
The Todd Father is up next. Here's the 3 1. Ball Outside ball four. I would say it'll take first. Severian's first walk of the day. Now he doesn't like it. It's around first base here with no outs. Now I'll bring Frazier. out Todd Frazier, former third baseman of the Cincinnati Reds. Here's Todd. <laughs> Try to steal. Here's the throw by Romine, and it's in time. Good job by Castro there. N not on target there by Austin Romine, but Castro, being the veteran he is, gets a chance there to get the runner. As you can see, is a little wide right, but Castro still gets the run. Oh, one wolf, one out. Oh, one. One and one. One, one. Two and Inside, one. two and one. Still one, nothing. Good guys. <laughs> good guys. Two, one. Oh. Up high. Three and one. Matt Davidson on deck. Oh. Three one. Line drive. Face it. For Todd. Yes. He gets in. And Todd will get in there. With the sink. Takes advantage Third of this changeup right down the part of the plate and Matt rips that for a Davidson. single. Here's Matt with a chance to increase the lead. First. Base. Just low. Severino wanted it, but he didn't get it. See Bob Ferguson, umpire, doesn't give the close ones. Seems way outside, two and out. We may soon see pitching coach. Uh, I don't know his name. Um, come out to the mound. Line drive foul. Step off. Let's look over again. I'll look at this. I think. Alright. Line drive. Face it. Move up, Frazier. And those socks. I have something going. The batter, number five, second baseman, Carlos Sanchez. There's bitch coach out from New York Yankees. Luis Servino giving up a few hits to sending. There are still no outs. And I drive. And he's not going to get. It. Yes, he is. That's a double play. No, he's Oh, oh no. Come on, you got to be on the base. Ah. Up next for the White Sox. Uh. Catcher. Come on. Kevin Smith. So the Sox are lucky here. <laughs> oh, yeah. Where's it? Way outside. Oh. <laughs> Your rages are hilarious. Oh my gosh. Oh. Faldo. Bye, Kevin. He has the only RBI today, and that was an RBI double. Swing and a miss. On to Mother Earth. <laughs> One and two. Come on, Mr. Reyes. Here comes Frazier. Here's the throw to the plate. And Frazier's gunned down. 
good relay there by the Yankees to get out of that pickle and allow no runs. Leading off for the Yankees. Here comes Chris Carter to lead it off. Baseman, Chris Carter. Here's the first pitch to the big man. Zero. Swing and a miss. That big time power. But it's strike one. Fly ball. I'll just say it. Can he get it? Yes, he will. First time. Now batting. Catcher. Here comes Austin, Austin Roman. Roman. Fly ball. Foul. Nice change up there. Protect. No in two. More pop-ups today. Yes. The batter, third baseman, Ronald Torres. Comes Torres up to play. Foul. A one. Just foul. Just foul. Oh. One and two. One, two, three. Ball. T.A. Yeah. That'll end the top F3 Yankees. It's still one nothing good guys. You're listening to Big Series Baseball. Do you know the little yellow thing? Like, and see that? Do you move it with right the side. left or right stick? Center fielder, I don't have it on. Garcia. Oh, okay. It's directional hitting. All right. Here's Willie now, taking call good. strike one. He's the third strikeout today for Luis Overino. The batter number seven, shortstop, Tim. <laughs> <laughs> so here's T. Oh, and Jack Bunt. That's a fair ball. That's a fair ball. What? He picked it up, though. Wait. <laughs> Wait, what's going on? <laughs> he just picked it up and threw it. <laughs> what? Apparently, that's a fair ball. What? <laughs> that might be. Uh, that, how's that legal? Come on. <laughs> Can we get a replay on that? Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. Um, Wait, here. Let me, do it. Let, me do it. let me do it. Let me do it. Let me do it. Let me do it. All right. <laughs> what? 
<laughs> so Luis Severino pitches the ball. All right, here, hold on. And the bunt goes down. Looks like a foul ball. It is a foul it ball. It is a foul ball, as you can see. <laughs> and it goes foul. It spins back. And to it the spins first. back in the foul territory. And, and he picks up the ball and throws it away. <laughs> <laughs> and it's a fair ball. And they decided to give several, and they decided to give T A the base. <laughs> My goodness. New York is sleeping on the job. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. First pitch to Melvin. One drive. Base hit. That's the diving Torres. Yes! <laughs> and the Sox have something going. Oh. The first baseman, number 79, Jose Abreu. Here's Jose. Hmm. Looks like the Yankees got Tommy Lane in the bullpen going. Outside, the ball one. Swing and a miss. Count is one and one. Right? Okay. That ball slices back. It's a count. One and two. Mm -hmm. Soft liner, but again, foul. Jose still survives. One drive, base hit. Gardner picked it up. Here comes TA. Coming home. And it is 2 0 sucks. Yeah. Yes. <sighs> oh, wait. Yeah, he's out. He's out there. Okay. Yeah. The batter, right fielder. Here comes Avasayu. Avasayu Garcia. RBI single for Jose. Ground ball. Six, five. Actually, I think it's five. Oh, all right. That's a force out. That'll end the inning. But the Sox do get one on the Jose Abreu single. It is two nothing good guys. Leading off for the Yankees, the left fielder, number 11. Brack There's Gardner now. Gardner. Leaning it off. One for two. I'm going to miss. Comes Jacoby Ellsbury. Jacoby Ellsbury. They're all good timing. I don't see why he's not hitting them. Hot by Sanchez for the second out. Now batting the designated hitter, Matt Holliday. First pitch on the left. Line drive. That was sale. One, two, three inning. Go down the Yankees. And it's still 2 nothing good guys. You are listening to Big Series Baseball. <laughs> Here's Todd. And leading off for the White Sox. Designated hitter, Todd Frazier. That will be the end of attention, please. Five innings pitched. Two runs given York. up. I don't know how many hits. Number 39. Eight, six. Tommy Lane. Mm -hmm. How do you how do you do that? Is that like the guest pitch? Yeah. All right. You gotta. Is that the? It's it's R two. R two. It's, it's R two, and you gotta spin it around with the uh, left and then stick. You, and then you gotta pick a pitch. Do you pick a pitch Third then spin it, or spin it then pick a pitch? Matt. Spin it, spin Every it time. then pick a pitch. Okay.
Oh! One ball. <laughs> that was bad. One out. We're gonna mess. One and one. Foul ball. Swing and a miss. Nice curveball there by Lang. That's the second out of the inning. Another strikeout. The batter number serve. five, second by baseman, Lang. Carlos Sanchez. First one. Ground ball. GD bobbles it. Thought yeah. it was the first in time. Yeah. Yeah. They will make up for it. And we go to the top of the seventh inning. White Sox still lead 2 0. Now, here's the in case you're just tuning in, Chicago's currently up 2 0. Two runs on nine hits. Yankees, zero runs on three hits. No home runs today, but it we'll doesn't see. mean there won't be. So here's to Castro, 0 for 2 with two flyouts. Starlin Castro. Run ball to Matt. Fires to first in time. One away. The right one fielder number 99, Aaron Judge. Zero. We got a mess. Jason, hi. No ball, one strike. My ball hit well. Off the wall. Takes a weird carom. Milky's chasing. Ah! Him. What the heck? I pressed L1. It's this one. Yeah, that's what I was doing. Now oh. batting. Shortstop. DD Gregorius. Check it first. Yep, he got it. Safe. Nice high curveball. Tap foul. Find over. Blooper. That's it. Hey, he's looking for something here in the seventh. Now batting. So blue the first baseman. Hey. Chris Carter. There's Carter now. Chris Carter looking for something. Oh, one and oh. Popped up, Kevin. First out of here. Port to that side. Now batting, catcher, Austin Roman. D-Rod! Oh, one. one ball, one strike. Trouble. Six. Oh. That's all they get. Certainly. Ladies and gentlemen, Something it's time for the traditional Something stretch seven time stretch. here in Chicago. Do nothing good, guys. Here's Kevin. And now up for the White Sox. Catcher. Kevin Smith.
Red ball. Dee Dee. Please stop fires. The first. Yeah. Now batting. First base on fire. Here's Willie. Oh for two. Here's Bunt. Swing and a miss. That was an ugliest of swings I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> Grab ball. Torres picks it up. Fires the first. Got him. Nice play. Good snag by Torres. Gets a throw on the first in time for out number two. Tim Anderson. So there's Tim. He had a controversial Bunt single. <laughs> last time. <laughs> One drive. Ellsbury coming in. Dives. Can't get it. I'll go all the way to the wall. Gardner picks it up. T.A. going to three. And he'll get there. Sliding. Yes. He's safe. Wow. T.A. Triple. Fielder number 53. Take a look at this Contrera. again. See a little looper in the center. Ellsbury thought he might have had a chance at it. Not enough. Here's Melky. Here is coming home in time. Tries to fool Romine. Almost got it, but we go to the top of the eighth. It's still two nothing. Good guys. Ronald Torres. Grab ball off Cantana. Let's hope he's all right. Save over first. And he's hurt. Your attention, Anthony please. Swarzak will now come now in, former White Sox, rail rider and former Yankee. Acquired this offseason by the Chicago Wolves. So. Great job. Mm -hmm. Yeah, could be playing a big part in the game. Here comes Get Brett that. Gardner, top of the order for the Yankees <coughs> in a very Number crucial 11. time in this game. Brett Gardner. Oh, he's on there. Check him first. Make sure he's not going. That was right there. Oh, I know. Steals L2, right? Yeah. Okay. Nope, that's low. <laughs> now he's in there. He's safe. He's safe. <laughs> oh, I'm striking. He gone. <laughs> nice job there by Swarzak. Now so strike out Gardner. The center fielder, Jacoby. Ellsbury. Two, four, six, three. 
three. You're gone. In time. Yeah. Still two nothing. Good guys. Go to the bottom of the eight. There's Melky. And leading off for the White Sox. Left fielder. Melky Cabrera. Batances warming up in the skanky bullpen. My drive. Face hit in front of Ellsbury. And Melky's on with his first face hit of Z Day. The first baseman, number 79. Here's Jose. One, two, three. Abreu. Step off. Melky to second. Jose to first. Yes. Here's Abby. Now batting. Up. Right fielder. Abasayu Garcia. Come ball. Should be two. Oh, what the heck? It gets past. Second baseman Castro. Here comes Melky. He scores. 3 0 ball game. Yes. Up next for the White Sox. Uh, you got to think uh, oh. I'm good. <laughs> so you should do this. I'm not going to walk him. Strike three, caught looking. And what a big out that Up is. Next for Chicago, third baseman, Matt Davidson. Look, look, look. Oh, I went too soon. How was it going to go for him? Yeah. <laughs> Job by the Yankees preventing another run coming the in. Job by Aaron Judge and they're now two down. Carlos There's Carlos Sanchez. now. Oh. Line drive. Nobody's gonna get that one. Two score. Carlos to second. And they'll be out. But the Sox do get three. And it's five nothing. Good guy. Going top nine. Leading off for the Yankees, the designated hitter, Matt Holliday. Here's Matt Holliday. Bubble. How do you When you get there? Yes. One down here at the top of the line. The batter number 14. Stay tuned for the post game highlights here in game one as Starling game two will be coming up here shortly. Quality at bat. And Gardner's on base. Here with one out. Sox looking for the double play to right end this game. But Aaron, Aaron Judge has definitely Easy. 
back in. Heads up. I got base hit. All right, Aaron Judge in with a single. Two runners on now for the Yankees with one out. Now the play still in effect. Didi Gregorius. Here's Dee Dee. <laughs> <laughs> I dropped it. Looking. Goes Dee Dee. Two down. You go. Now batting the first baseman, Chris Carter. Ah. No ball. One strike. There's no words to scrap that. Score. No ball. Two strikes. That was good timing. Why didn't I hit it? Swing him. That's the ball game. Sox win it five nothing. Yes. Yes. And a nice day today here for Sox Baseball. Go for Joe's win. The winning pitcher goes to Jose Quintana. Losing pitcher is Luis Severino. And the save goes to Anthony Swarzak, former Yankee. I want to thank you all for watching uh, Game Final 1 of the big series. Um, we will be back for Game 2 in just a moment. And, uh, we will have post-game highlights coming up next. You're listening to Big Series Baseball. Eight men on base. For the Yankees, no runs, eight hits, no errors. They left eight men on base. Time of the ball game, two hours and 46 minutes. A reminder that extra CTA Redline trains will be available at the Sox 35th Street Station and that Pace Go-Go Sox Express buses are available outside of guaranteed rate fields. 